Eclipse, level four mobilization. Location, Fisk Tower. Fisk? Did you take him down yet? No. We're at Fisk Tower, but still waiting on the warrant. Mind if I join in on the fun? You know how his lawyers are. This one needs to go by the book. Come on, Yuri. I've been waiting eight years for this. You really want to help? Head to Times Square. Sounds like his guys are trying to keep my backup from reaching the scene. You got it. Almost there. Wrap this up quick, then get to my real job. So Yuri called in the cavalry. Bring in the hammer. Okay, Yuri, all done. What's happening? Yuri? Yuri! I knew Fisk wouldn't go quietly. the airspace. Yuri, you okay? If he makes it out of that building, we're gonna lose him. Nah, I'm gonna go, uh... Do your thing. Yes! He's the day, Willie! Heads up! Hey, where are you going? Catch! Come on, come on! They shut the elevators down! Take the stairs! I prefer a more direct approach. Let's see just how good their security is. Aw, oh, you guys forgot the latest kernel patch. 
Says the guy frantically erasing his search history. After all these years, more still just an ignorant child. True, but that's part of my charm, isn't it? Damn you. Get that door down now! Clear! Move up! Hey guys, I guess bombs are part of Willie's getaway plan? You go after them. We'll look for the bombs. Ah, help! Everyone clear out! Evacuate the building! I heard more people back that way. I'll find them. Spider-Man! We can't move! We're pinned down! I'll lift it. When you're free, get out fast. If you can walk, help the injured. Got it? Go, go, go! Thank you. You guys all right? We were just about to call for backup. I think I'm it. Lead the way. We'll be right behind you. Heads up, boss. Hey, Yuri. Looks like some of your guys were on Fisk's payroll. Good news is, they were Willie's last line of defense. I'm right outside his office. Take him down, now. With pleasure. Writing your memoirs? Don't forget the hyphen between spider and man. Get the chopper ready. I won't be long. I'm surprised you made it this far. But your foolishness ends now. Uh, you do know I can still see you, right? Eight years of this insolence. Oh, for me? You shouldn't have. Gotta wait for an opening. Wait too long. What are you doing? How is this happening? What's wrong, Willie? You seem angry. I will destroy you! You are everything that's wrong with this city! Huh. I was gonna say the same to you. Finally off to Rikers, huh? You know, I think you've got more enemies in there than I do. 
If you think this will be more than a minor inconvenience... Whoop! Gotta go! Hey, good luck, Willy. I have a feeling you're gonna need it. Idiot! I'm the one who kept order in this city! One month! In one month you wish you had me back! I'm sorry I'm late. Oh. You started without me. The Grant Committee's director will be here soon. It's fine, Parker. I invented this equipment. I think I can handle it. Power damper. Oh, man. Um, maybe we should abort. Not yet. Hold on! Dr. Artavis, are you okay? <coughs> Another setback. <coughs> but we're close. Is anyone hurt? No, it, it, it was all the, my fault. The energy levels exceeded our expectations. From a certain viewpoint, that's a very positive development. It doesn't smell very positive. I assure you, in the next phase... Let's not get ahead of ourselves. <coughs> Is there somewhere else we can discuss this? Maybe you should take the rest of the day off, Peter. But we'll talk later. Spider-Man, it's Yuri. Fisk make it to Rikers yet? Not Rikers. Our boy qualifies for the VIP treatment. He's in the raft. Ah, joining Scorpion, Electro, and the rest. Fisk should be honored. That's a steamed company. Can you swing by the precinct? Got an issue that could benefit from your unique skill set. For you, Yuri, anything. I'm on my way. Now that you quit smoking, what do you tell people when you come up here? That I need a break from their crap. Fair enough. So, why'd you call? Need a date to the policeman's ball? You got a black and white suit? Uh... No ball this year anyway. We spent too much integrating Oscorp surveillance tech. Worth it though, right? It was. Until an hour ago. The well, system went down. Citywide. Every tower. How? They tell me someone sabotaged the central server, and now all the towers are offline. Hmm. Inside job? Maybe. We'll figure it out later. Right now, we need to get the towers back online. Fast. And you called me? Aw, that's sweet. I called someone I could trust. Plus, the signals are scrambled, and we have no idea how to fix it. Ooh. I love a challenge. You break it, you buy it. I thought you trusted me. So you're the snitch. Back off, creep. Yep, she's the one. I said back off! Leave me alone! Keep me quiet, lady. Get away from her! All clear, ma'am. I knew Jameson was wrong about you. You're a little weird, but you got a good heart. Have you got somewhere to go? I could take care of myself. I I'm sure you can, but just in case, there's a place called the Feast Center. Seen it. I don't want charity. They got the best wheat cakes in the city, hands down. Mom used to make those. Haven't had any in a long time. I'll check it out. Thanks, spider guy. It's spider man. What's up, dude? Open the safe! Do it! 
Hey, fellas. Ah! Spider-Man! Shoot him! Parker! Dr. Octavius, I, uh, uh, what you got there? Chinese. If I know you'd be here, I would've... What are you working on? Oh, just a side project. <sighs> of course. It's you. I, uh, I, I, I don't know what oh, you're... Oh, come on, Parker, it's obvious. L let me explain. I only wish you'd told me sooner. I wanted to. I was afraid that if word got out, my family might be in danger. Huh. Yes. Uh, I guess if you design his equipment, you're bound to be a target too. Yeah. Um, yeah. Don't worry. Your secret's safe. Well, I'll leave you to it. Mr. Lee. Hello? Peter, it's Martin Lee. I just wanted to let you know we need a little extra time to get set for May's party. I guess the cake delivery is stuck in traffic. Oh, sure thing. Just let me know when you're ready and I'll swing by. Great. Talk to you soon. Hey, Martin, so sorry I'm late. You were right on time. Just keep her distracted while we get everything ready. You got it. Hey, there's my favorite aunt. Peter, what a nice surprise. Need some help? Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, there are some heavy no, boxes. No, no, no. I mean, I mean, I mean, not yet. I mean, I came to, uh, uh, uh I just, just wanted to talk. Okay. Okay. Come on. Um. Peter, are you in trouble? Do you need money? No, no, I mean, I mean I'm a little behind on my rent, but no, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Girl problems again, huh? What? No, that's crazy. I still wish you and MJ could work things out. She's a great girl. She is, but... The two of you would make some beautiful wow. baby. Uh... Peter. What is it? Come on. You can tell me. These past few years, you helping me through college and working here, Sacrificing so much and asking for nothing. I just wish there were more people like you in the world. He's right. Five years ago, you walked in here and told me you were inspired by my mission to help others. Now it's you who inspires me. Thank you, May, for everything. Here's for many more years of service. Thanks again for setting all this up. Oh, I just wish I could do more. Well, May's always told me if you help someone... You help everyone. <laughs> now, maybe we should send May to City Hall to have a word with the mayor. Oh, I gotta run. Um, thanks again for the party and everything. It, it, it really means a lot. Peter, I lost track of you at the party. Yeah, I, uh, I had to get to the lab. Sorry. Don't apologize. I just wanted to tell you how much what you said meant to me. I always wonder if I'm doing right by you. Well, stop wondering. After losing my parents and Uncle Ben, there are so many times I would have fallen apart if not for you. 
Well, that works both ways, Peter. I just wanted to make sure you knew that. May, I... I don't know what to say. Oh, I think Mr. Lee needs my help. I should go. See you soon, dear. I love you. Love you too. I am losing patience. Where is the file? There's someone else here. They must have taken it. Those masks. Who are these guys? There's no one here but us. We will find the file. Or you will die. This is bad. They'll kill her if I alert them. Need to pick them off silently. Yuri, the silent alarm was legit. Masked gunmen and a single hostage. Looks like a heist in progress. Copy that. Sending units your way. Keep the situation from getting worse in the meantime. Can do. This totally belongs to... Don't move! Buddy, if I had a nickel for every don't move... Hey, Pete. MJ, what are you doing here? Same as you. Working. At least, I was. Oh, I uh, think this is yours. Yeah, thanks. So Robbie's got you covering a break-in for the bugle? Well, Robbie doesn't technically know I'm here. And it wasn't a break-in until a few minutes ago. Uh, uh-huh. Let me explain. Excuse me. Hi, Mary Jane Watson. I am covering the Fisk Estate sale. Uh, hello. Craig said we'd do this tomorrow. I like to get a jump on things. Well, I don't. You'll have to come back tomorrow. Right. Okay. I'm sorry. Hey, Craig? No, sorry. It just... It looks like we're gonna have to run something else on the cover. I don't know, uh, maybe the expressionist piece? You know what? I think I can make today work. Are you sure? You're here, no moment like the present. Thank you. Craig? Never mind, we're good. Let's get started. Motor vehicle for English, press one. Wait, I recognize that statue. I gotta get a photo. That shouldn't be here. Got it. Craig, I'll call you back. My dear, I think it's time for you to go. Oh, um, could I use the restroom real quick? Fine. Follow me. Thank you. This... this is a really lovely space. It is. And this will be the last time you see it. The ladies is around the corner. Be quick. Of course. Be right back. Hello, Craig. Funny you should call. Because the reporter you sent is clearly not working the puff piece we agreed upon. No, she's here now. I've got to get into that back room. If that statue is what I think it is... Pete told me about this. Norman Osborne. What is this? Devil's Breath. What is devil's... What the... Excuse me, sir. You... you can't be... Not good. Where's the statue? In... in... in, in there. Put I was on my way to the exit when I saw you. You're lucky to be alive. Says the guy I saved five minutes ago. Listen, 
Whoever these masked guys are, they're after this file. But I'll never get it out of here while the place is swarming with them. Right. Okay. Um, you hide back there. I take out the bad guys. You make a break when it's clear. Sounds like a plan. Good to see you, Pete. Yeah, you too. Not exactly how I pictured us meeting again, though. Funny. It's exactly how I pictured it. Stop! No. Hide! Not cool with the hostage taking, guys. Antique. I think I know someone who could help track down where this came from. A job for later. I just talked to Craig. You are not the reporter he was sending. You don't even work for Heritage Arts. Never said I did. Hi, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. You. You will not write a word of what you saw. For the here. record, what do you know about the file those masked men stole? That. I don't. What about the long history of stolen goods Fisk has laundered at this auction house? Your editor will be hearing from our attorney. Mix? <laughs> like the last six months never happened? Since when did Mix become Italian? No idea, but I'm still glad to mix these fries. Totally. Best in the city. So, how's the grind at the Bugle? Mm. Well, yeah, well, I just got an all caps text from Robbie about my so-called antics tonight. So it looks like I'll be meeting with a legal team. Again. Uh, as soon as he reads the article you're gonna write, guaranteed promotion. So, creepy mask guys. What's your take? Just another night in the city. What's your take? I feel like there's a bigger story there. Let's not make this all about business. How's, how's it going with you? Did, did you get that promotion? No, but we're on the cusp of something really big. You know Oscorp would hire you in a heartbeat, right? One phone call to hair. Sure, but Dr. Octavius' work will help millions. I'm, I'm right where I want to be, right where I should be. Almost oh, sounds like it's more important than your other job. I've never heard you talk like that before. A lot can change in six months. Why did you ask me here, Pete? You know, just, uh, just dinner between friends. Friends? Is that what we are? Well, maybe we could be, you know, if, if, if that's what you wanted. <laughs> There's a lot of baggage here. Yeah, sure, but is that so bad? I mean, baggage can carry good things, too, like, uh, like money and uh, keys and raspberry lip balm. Do you remember why we broke up? This is a trick question, isn't it? Saved by the siren. Talk to you later. Go. Cool. Love seeing you two together again. You always were my favorites. Hi, Herman. Seriously? <laughs> You know 
know what, Herman? You have like zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? <laughs> Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Peter. What can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. She wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where did she find it? I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? Uh, I don't know. Why take the risk? How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes. <laughs> hey, hey, what do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now. This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. <sighs> Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work in a secure environment. At Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. Easy, easy, easy. They, they, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. Herman, long time no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but uh, I'm 
Pretty sure that's a parole violation. <laughs> Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Wanna play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb rest? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa, your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You wanna fight? Let's fight! Man, can't wait to put you back on my bar so we can talk science. You know, people don't use banks anymore. You're lucky you found actual cash. If you really want to rob banks, try day trading. It's all the rage. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. Oh, come on, Herman. Give up now and we can protect you! No way! You ain't see what I see! You son of a... Okay, I was kidding before. Now is your last, last chance. Seriously. Sorry, Herman. You brought this on yourself. Literally. Man, he was scared and desperate. These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. They set one toe inside the vault. I'll have your head. Got it, boss. Tripling security. Demons won't touch a thing. Listen up! Demons are making moves on all our caches. Lost two tonight already. Boss may be in lockup, but that don't mean his hardware's up for grabs. Com check, Eagle 2, you up? Eagle 2 reporting in, eyes on. What caches are the demons after? I need to take out Fisk's men and figure out what they're guarding. Whatever it is, I don't want it in Fisk's or the demons' hands. Snipers everywhere. A lot of junk scattered around here. A well-placed web shot could make a great distraction. You know we can't have vigilantes trespassing or doing illegal searches. Yeah, I know. Which is why I brought a warrant. So what do you say we do some perfectly legal searching? I like the sound of that. What's your name? Officer Davis. Call me Jeff. And you are? Uh... uh... <laughs> Just messing with you. My son's a big fan. So, that warrant cover breaking down doors? Not without a lot of extra paperwork. Okay. I'll find another way in. Well, that isn't spooky at all. Probably an old bootlegger's tunnel. And it looks like no one's cleaned it since Al Capone. Big chunk of concrete in the way. Damn. Demons are already gone. How'd they beat us here? Must be a back door. See if you can find it. This place is one hell of an armory. Or was. There. They blew the locks to get in. Stay here. Hell no. It'll take both of us to stop them. And some of these. Good move. Let's go. Get him! Okay? I'll get you. If 
If I lose two trucks full of gunmen in one day, it's time to hang up the web. Don't get shot. I gotta get in close. Hey guys, room for one more? to run on time. We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the Bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are gonna tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Up in. She's good. Empire Sanitation, this is Eddie. Yeah, hi. Uh, I'm trying to track down some items that were accidentally picked up from a dumpster outside my apartment. Dumpster number? Uh, uh, hang on. Uh, 64476. That's Route 33. Truck's already left at shift. If your stuff's not there, you're out of luck. Wait, wait, please. This is important. Can you at least tell me where the truck is? Uh, let me check. All right. Looks like it should be at the municipal garage at Bowery and Grand. Got it. Thanks, Eddie. Please be here. Please be here. Yes. Hope it still works. Look, it's that guy who makes his spider man. Uh-oh. Ice him! What is that? Okay, well, this night isn't quite going as planned. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ's. Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, 
Looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. Miss you. I can't take this. You can and you will. I'll pay you back soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, I really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. Consolidated shipping. Jeff, I'm here. What do you see? Find the rest. The boss wants them dead. Looks like the demons are moving in on Fisk's territory. You got this? I got this. You got what you came for. You don't need to kill us, too. <laughs> Fisk's territory is ours now. Not today. Hey, Willie. You. Nice jumpsuit. Slimming. Stay out of my business. Wait, the demons. Who's their leader? Keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you. Saving bad guys from other bad guys. Not how I thought today would go. just happened? Yeah. Hope 
I live to regret this. Hi, is this the flight to Newark? Masks are so awesome. Where do you get them? Oh, I cool, thanks. Do they have a website? Yes. Whoops. Hey, Yuri. I caught the bad guys, but... But what? You might want to bring a ladder. Yo, Miles. Hey, fanboy. I'm late. You coming? Uh, nah, I gotta get to City Hall for my dad's ceremony. All right. Tell your pops I said congrats. MJ, did they start the ceremony yet? They're still setting up. Where are you? Got hung up at work. Be there soon. There's the stage entrance. And we'll be right out front. Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. Last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. Well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> or maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> Come on, honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so, so? Such exemplary citizens I think this gang war may finally be over. With that, like, I would like, to hand like it over, to over? over? I'm, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends. Well... A truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um... Well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. But, uh... Instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery, above and beyond the call of duty, it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with a department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Uh, 
Thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family, my wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes? I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass, I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer. Over there. Right there. leave now Dad. 
I'm sorry for your loss. Do I know you? I'm Peter Parker. I was at City Hall when... Look, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to say... I know what you're going through. Uh, that's what you were gonna say, right? Or it all gets easier with time. Don't worry, it's, it's part of God's plan. I'm sorry, I was just try trying to help. I know. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what I'm gonna do with him. Jeff. I'm busy. What's up? Have you started looking for Martin Lee yet? No. I told you, I can't start a manhunt based on a hunch from Spider-Man. But I'm telling you, he's the guy. Get me some solid evidence and we'll talk. Solid evidence. Right. Hey, it's me. Hey. So, what are you thinking? I'm thinking I screwed up and that kid lost his father. I know you too well to say you should give yourself a break. What about the police? Do they have any leads on Lee? They're not even looking for him. Even Yuri doesn't believe me. Then it's up to us to find him. I've been doing some research. Go to this address. Martin Lee bought a controlling interest in this recycling center last year. You think he's hiding out there? Maybe. We know he's not at Feast. If he's not at the recycling center, maybe you'll find some evidence as to where he might be. Yeah. Good work, MJ. I'll let you know what I find. Oh, one more thing. I talked with a detective about questioning the arrested demons. They're all claiming Martin Lee has the power to, quote, corrupt people. Corrupt? What does that mean? They say it's sort of like mind control. It brings out the negative part of you. It makes you do things you wouldn't normally do. Hmm, sounds a little far-fetched. This is coming from a guy who can run up walls. high-tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. These must be where they're planning to attack. Wait, these are Osborne campaign offices. All the paths originate from the same address. Guns from Fisk's armory.
truck bombs. This is crazy. Explosives from Fisk's construction site. This wasn't a gang war. The demons were stealing from Fisk to go after Mayor Osborne. Hey, did you find Lee? No, but you were right. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running. Oh my god. And it looks like they're planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. We must have some kind of beef with Norman Osborne. I found an address here. I think it's their staging area. If I hurry, I might be able to stop them. Be careful. Yuri, it's me. Make it quick. I'm busy getting yelled at by my boss. Martin Lee and the demons are planning another attack, this time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. Are you sure? We've had a lot of false leads in the past week. Trust me on this one. I'm sending you the address of a recycling center. You'll find all the evidence there. Got it. I'll get those campaign offices evacuated. But if you're wrong about this, you're gonna help me find a new job. Huh. The invoice from an auto shop. Pale horse rides. That's one expensive tune-up. This is bigger than I thought. Looks like the demons have an army. As if one deadly glowing whip wasn't enough. Copy, Silverbird. We're descending to location. There's another one. Safety's off. Well, this is new. No, no, no. This one's mine. All right. I'm executing this son of a... Hey! That's not how we do things! Down! Down! Code SM1. Whoa, whoa! Before we do this... Who the hell are you guys? Code SM1. Code SM1. Holding for orders. Copy code SM1. I have a visual. Hold for Silverbird. Nice entrance. Solid 8 out of 10. Nine out of 10. Release him. He works with us. Yuri, explanation, please. This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International. A private security force. Paid for by Mayor Osborne. Oh, the mayor has a pet army now? Next time you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. Go. We'll talk later. I should have told you earlier, but it all happened so fast. It's okay. We're still best buds. We're not best buds. Well, that took a dark turn. Anyway, Sable has the mayor's ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin Lee. I'm working on that. Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. 
here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No. Why? I'm just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. This office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. I don't feel safe in Whoa. What are you hiding, Lee? Whoa. This is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Phew. It's a burn room. Wired to destroy evidence. Now, how do I get out of here? Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. You get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. Ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test.
So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that, and, well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. You sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. You're not gonna believe what happened. So you know that address you gave me? I went there. MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? That office. Might be something inside that connects this to Lee. What's in these? Boss! Come on! We'll never notice! Tombstone. You're right, Rick. Won't notice? Cause it won't be there! God damn it! I said I'll fix it! You got some stones, Rick. <laughs> Let's see if they break. A disappointment. <laughs> and now I need a new welder. GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? All right, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... Whatever you're cooking right now, <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry, uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope.
You are never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. The Great Dumpling Catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves devil's breath. Whatever that is. Yeah. I'll dig into it. So I was thinking... What if we teamed up? What, what, you want to be my sidekick? Like a spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh, Oscorp CFO. Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did... Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where do you want me to, uh... Just a couch is fine. <laughs> yeah. See you later? Yeah. You're hurt. I'm okay. But you gotta find Mr. Standish. Fast. Those guys in the masks kidnapped him and forced him up to his place. He lives in the penthouse. Top floor. Okay, sit tight. So glad you're here. I can't find my car. I could have sworn I parked on this level. There's Standish. Okay, now what? Enter your password. It's safe now. What were they after? Just... Financial records. About Devil's Breath? How do you know about that? Why do they want it? I don't even know what it is. Mr. Osborne's been pouring money into it for years, but he keeps the whole project a secret. I'm the only one who has any record of it. Not anymore. Looks like they copied some records to a secure server. Payroll information. On a Dr. Isaac Delaney. Who is he? I, I honestly don't know. Down! Come on, come on! Wait, the elevator! <laughs> Hold on! I almost got him! Try to fall slower! Gotcha! You okay? Yeah. I think so. Good. Good. You know, as elevator shafts go, this is pretty nice. <laughs> hey, Yuri. You okay? Yeah, but I didn't get much out of Standish before these Sable guys stepped in and told me to back off. What's the deal? I get the sense all they care about is keeping him quiet. Because he knows about Devil's Breath. Right. Whatever the hell that is. I'm working on that. I think I just got a lead. A lead? You sound like a cop. Don't you mean... Spider Cop? I'm looking for Isaac Delaney. I think he's on the dance floor. There he is, the lizard in the lab coat. Hey, look, it's Spider Boy. Isn't some one of your nemesis? We got to uh, fight. Maybe later. Oh, what's the matter, Spider Whip? You afraid of my mighty horn? Hey, hey who? What, what are you? Come on. 
Hey! Fight! Kick fight. his ass, Spider-Man! What the hell? Oh, snap! recently began working with someone in an Oscorp lab. How do, you, how do you know that? We don't have much time, Isaac. Tell me his name. Show's over, Lee. Apparently the show's not over. His name, Dr. Morgan Michaels. Thank you. Yuri, I need your help. I've got reports of shots fired at ESU. Yeah, that's me. I'll explain later. But right now, you need to find a Dr. Morgan Michaels. Martin Lee's coming after him. Copy that. GR-27? Hmm. Dr. Morgan Michaels is the chief scientist, but the location of the lab is redacted. AI-controlled CRISPR? If that actually works, it could cure any genetic disease. Cystic fibrosis, Huntington's, this is crazy. Creepy. Whoa, GR-27 is devil's breath. It's designed to cure diseases. But in its current form, it's like a bioweapon. Dr. Michaels keeps the only sample with him at all times. That's why Lee wants him. We find Michaels, we find Devil's Breath. Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles, where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. Okay. 
If he wants to kill me, you tell him to do it. Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. And I want to see Lee stopped. Just like you. What's that? I've read your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> what the... Charles! Oh! What that the was hell? not a Sable guy. Definitely not a Sable guy. Sorry, Charlie. Okay, time to Wait, go. No, he knows something. I'd call that a mild success. I'd call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but it can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future... I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. What are you doing here? just made your last mistake, punk. What the? You hurt? You're Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. 
But next time, leave the fighting to the pros, okay? Uh, okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time, but when I do it, I have... Oh, oh like that time you fought Ryan on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect example. <laughs> if the other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's, that's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing, don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet, and when they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah, yeah, that's it, okay. Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jock, okay? I can take <clears throat> Oh, sh... S sorry. No, 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 <laughs> it's all good. You keep that up and uh, you'll be fine. All right, lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey, uh, thanks. You know, anytime. I just punched Spider Man. Just when you're coming out of here, shelter should be just ahead. Yo, Miles, what's up? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider-Man. What? That's crazy. Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, you suck. He totally would've bought it off you, and then we'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be late. Uh, cool. Later. Farmer's market. I can cut through there. Mom? Hi, honey. Did you make it to the feast shelter okay? Uh, yeah. Almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. This is mine. Okay. Sorry. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. I love you so much. We'll get through this, okay? I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. I'm seeing, I'm seeing depth of dead demon faces. And you know what, just, just keep breathing. I'll, I'll be back soon, Mr. Hunter. Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no, I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um... What can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. <clears throat> oh, hell! Damn hunk of junk! Uh, you mind if I take a look? Eh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these when they're... CR what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Got the time. Get it. Go it. Or, could be a loose coax cable. <laughs> all right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Hey, 
Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, new kid. I'm empty wife, here. Rio and son Miles, as well as brother Aaron. In addition to the hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. <laughs> hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's gonna be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thanks. Uh, listen, Kat, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. See if Aunt May needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. I'll grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. We're ready for you, Dr. Michaels. Is that the devil's breath? It's called GR-27, not... <sighs> Just be careful. In the wrong hands, this could... Don't worry. We're the best in the world. I feel better already. Code 381, package is on the move. This way, Dr. Michaels. What the hell is that? Welcome aboard, Doctor. Get off me! We got this! Yeah, sure you do. Clear the guys in the trucks before I go after Lee. What are you doing to me? 
giving you a new perspective. What the hell? I must be honest. I was hoping to bring you here. My abilities lend me a certain persuasiveness. I've been watching you. I was waiting for you at City Hall. You never came. Where were you? Is this real or in my mind? It was a shame so many had to die with no heroes to save them. That officer saved your life, didn't he? He was here because of you. And Norman wanted to use him. A futile gesture in the end. And where was Norman during all this? Slinking away like a rat. He knew what was going to happen. And he fled. Norman is a hidden cancer on this city. He must be excised with no trace of his corruption to return. Norman hides behind his mask of lies. I will break it apart and drag him into the light. Put on the mask. Become one of us. Thanks, but no thanks! <laughs> before me. I will pull your mask off and expose you. The shadows are sworn to me, and I will give them strength. Mask. Okay. Did they take it? Yes. How worried should I be? Very. You're a popular guy. Where is the serum? I'm gone. The Discoya. So-called superhero. You think you save people, but you just make it worse. This is your fault. My fault? He was under your protection. You really need two of those? <laughs> Stop! We need to brief Mr. Osborne now. I'll go with her. Thank you. I'll remember this. Spider-Man. Hello? Is this working? Dr. Michaels? How are you calling? Borrowed one of Sable's radios. Listen, transit hubs are the most likely release points for Devil's Breath. Airports, bus terminals, train stations. It'll spread like wildfire from there. Why the hell is Oscorp developing a bioweapon in the city? Shouldn't this be in an Arctic bunker? Devil's Breath is personal for Norman. It's been his obsession for decades. The project breaks every state and federal regulation on the books, but he doesn't care. If the city finds out, he can kiss re-election goodbye. Oh, never mind re-election. He'd be tried in the Hague for war crimes. Why are you telling me all this? Aren't you just as culpable as Norman? Yes. Completely. But Lee's actions have been a wake-up call. We've ignored the project's risk for too long. I trust you, Spider-Man. You're the only one trying to do the right thing. Please, protect the city from our mistakes. Devil's breath is gone. I should call MJ and Warner. This is Mary Jane Watson. Please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. What are you up to now, MJ? And in turn, leaves our oceans and rivers cleaner than when man first walked the earth. Mr. Lee. 
This will be easier for everyone if you remain calm and do as I say. Police! Over here! office. I would like to speak to Mayor Osborne. Who's calling? The man he is looking for. What do you want? I want you at Grand Central Terminal in 30 minutes. By yourself. Or there'll be more blood on your hands. I have a direct line to Mayor Osborne. I can help make sure he arrives on time. How? First, let him go. Remember? Can we argue later? If we don't help those people, they could die. So could you. I can't let that happen. No. No, I got myself into this. I'm getting myself out. What do you mean you got yourself into this? Nigga, Jesus, I nolly. Gotta get past him. I'm ready. Renji, hi, dear Do it. Start the timer. Now's your chance. Got it. You did it. Wow. Yeah. Now let's get these people out of here. I could use a little Spidey help. You ready? Right. I'll clear a path. Try to do it quietly. Will do. Everyone, follow me! Tree's moving. Lee's getting away. Finally. Sorry I'm late. It's kind of my thing. Why are you doing this? Paying off an old debt. Let me help you, Mark! 
No brakes? No problem. Uh, it totally worked last time. Yuri, they still doing construction on 42nd and 1st? Streets closed for another month. Why? <laughs> Next stop, prison. And please leave a detailed message, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, hey, it's me. Let me know when you want to talk. Texting isn't talking? No, 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 not that kind of over! Please say no. Huh. Okay, okay. And not okay. What is there to figure out? Oh, you think? Just in time to celebrate. Celebrate? W wait. W where are the arms? Oh, wow. So cool. But how did you... Intracranial neural network. Neurotransmission speeds under one nanosecond. Faster than signals travel inside the brain. Never mind to an external prosthesis. We did it, Peter. No one can take this away from us. Amazing. I... And your work on the neural web was the key. But we haven't even tested it yet. There's so much we don't know. It works beautifully. Uh, come on, take a look. This is bad. Doctor? Doctor, I've found a potential problem. Everything has problems if you look hard enough. But fortune favors the bull. It's time to show the world what we've done. Otto, the neural web isn't isolating your motor neurons. 
It could be affecting other parts of your brain, your, your inhibitions, your mood. I, I just think we need some more tests. We've got enough tests! For the first time in my life, I don't feel like a failure. I feel like me. Otto, you're not a failure. But this could permanently damage your mind. Please. Right. Right. Don't worry. We're close. I'll keep at it. I'll work out some bugs. Go. Go. You sure you're okay? Yes. Thank you, Peter. For... For everything. We now take you live to Grand Central Terminal, where Mayor Osborne is about to address the media. Martin Lee is now behind bars. When I make a promise to this city, I keep it. The people of New York will soon make a decision that can change the course of this city forever. When you're casting your vote, remember what I've done. We are all safer now than we have ever been. Liar! You have no idea what you're in for. Peter! Y you okay? <sighs> I'm getting by. I don't know how I feel about you running this place all by yourself. And these people need help. If I lose a few hours of sleep, so be it. So have you heard from Mr. Lee since? No. But the Martin I know couldn't have done that. Whatever's become of him, that's not the one I want to remember. So, how are things with MJ? Oh, it's, uh... Well, you know, she's, uh, it's, uh, it's, it's complicated. Honesty. That's what got me and Ben through the rough patches. You guys had rough patches? Oh, sure. Especially when we were your age. So, are you honest with her? Does she know the real you? Hey, turn it up. I want to hear this. A spokesperson for the police has confirmed that this was the truck carrying the device used in the Grand Central Terminal attack. Oh, it never ends. Peter? The devil's breath is gone, but we got even bigger problems. Rikers? We have to hurry. Hop on. What happened? It was a coordinated attack. Must have been planned from the outside. Every cell block is breached. We're minutes away from every prisoner and Rikers walking right up Fifth Avenue. What about the raft? Should be okay. It's a supermax facility. Better security and a separate power grid. Good. What about the Devil's Breath? Sable's handling it. Do you trust them? Do I have a choice? Uh-oh. Should have worn your seatbelt. Take him out. Hurry. I'm on it. Spider Man. They're coming! Where is everybody? They're attacking my car! Help the warden! I'll keep working on getting the power restored! Right, I'm on it! Hey! Warden! Come on out! Gotta take them all out! Hold it! 
Okay, looks like things are somewhat under control. I thought you said the raft was secure. It was. Let's go. Maybe it's not as bad as it looks. I love the optimism. But in my experience, when it looks bad, it's usually worse. Look out! Yuri! Ah! I'm slipping! Gotcha! Hold on! Uh, uh. You okay? Yeah. Welcome to the party! Just in time for the fire! Looks like we made parole, boys! Electro? Why is he letting everyone out? I'll head for the main control center and see how bad the situation is. Got it. I'll go join the party. What's your status? Me? Just trapped in a prison with every criminal I've put away. <laughs> this is too good to be true. Scorpion, can you hold on a minute? I was in the middle of a phone call and it was business. <laughs> Come on, Spider-Man. I thought this was a chase. Stop this guy. You can't stop me. But I'm glad of that you still try. If you tell me who you're working for, I'll go easy on you. Try. Nobody ever takes me up on that offer. How do you like my new suit? Dashing. Where'd you get it? It's an exclusive club.
first and final warning. Stay out of our way. Each of you has a job to do. Your debts will be repaid when we're done. Go! It's over, Norman. Time to give them the truth. Can you pass us out for me? Sure. But they are working around the clock on a cure for this deadly disease. The citywide quarantine is being heavily enforced by Sable International, who maintain tight security over all transit points. Throughout the city, police and Sable agents continue to battle with Rikers and Raft escapees. Meanwhile, Mayor Osborne has gone on record blaming Spider-Man for the prison break and citywide sickness, and branding him a fugitive. But he has yet to provide evidence. And many believe the mayor is just deflecting blame, since an exclusive report by the Bugle revealed that this disease originated in a secret, unregulated Oscorp laboratory here in Manhattan. Mayor Osborne insists that Oscorp Turn is it off. the NDC on an anti-serum, but has not provided any further evidence to support this claim. Which means I have 192 non-broken ones. Thanks for taking care of me, by the way. The hard part was keeping you hidden from Sables. They've branded you a priority target, you know. I humbly accept the honor. What is happening to our city, Yuri? I don't know. Feels like the end of the world. Maybe it is. Peter! Thank God! We need you at the Veterans Center. Where are you? I got held up. Are you okay? What's happening? The convict started a fire. We got the building staff out, but May and Miles are trapped inside. I'm trying to find a way into them, but the fire is spreading so fast. Stay where you are, MJ. I'll handle this. Damn it. Move it, Pete. Move! Peter, fire and rescue's on the way. I found a fire escape that'll get me- MJ, stay back. I don't want to have to rescue you too. Peter, don't be crazy. Wait for help. May! May! Here! We're over here! Uh. 
I got you. Hang on! Oh. Hey, man, you all right? Get to the window! It's too far. Uh, hold on! Just brace yourselves! Come on, you stupid piece of... Come on, May. I've got you. Oh, my God. Go! Go! Uh. Miles! Come on! No! May okay? Everyone is safe. MJ, if it weren't for you and Miles, I would have been... As dead as I would have been the last eight and a half thousand times you saved me. Pretty sure I still owe you a few. <laughs> uh, uh, that's smart. <laughs> hey. I'm sorry I screwed things up. It's just hard being the one who always gets saved, you know? Sometimes I want to do the saving. I'm sorry I made you feel like you couldn't. Still partners? Always. Oh. Hey, uh, so I didn't know if, uh, you wanted sparkling or, or flat or spring or mountain spring, so I got one of each. Am I interrupting? No. Um, MJ, Ms. Watson, and I were just talking strategy. Strategy? That's right. The city is in danger. It needs our help. All of our help. All right, well, call the play, coach. Okay. Divide and conquer. Ms. Watson, we need an anti-serum for Devil's Breath. Oscorp's developing something, but there's no way they can keep it safe from Octavius and Lee. We need to find the cure and protect it. I'll chase down some leads. Miles, you need to be my eyes and ears at feast. Anything goes wrong, call me. We need to keep that place and the people there safe. All right, you got it. What are you gonna do? Gang of costume nutjobs is taking the city apart piece by piece. Time I return the favor. Hey, wait, um, how do I call you? I mean, do you, do you have like a cell phone in your, in your po pockets or something? Ms. Watson can give you my number. Good luck, team. Do you have his number? Are you Spider-Man's girlfriend? That'd be so cool. If... Uh, come on, Sherlock. Show me what you got in this water smorgasbord. Lee's going after the Devil's Breath anti-serum, using something called Icarus? Seems like the last stage of the plan is a direct assault on Oscorp, and most likely Norman. What's Vulture doing in Times Square? I need to keep my guard up. Electro's disabling Oscorp power plants. Makes sense. Rhino's targeting Oscorp's shoreline properties. Which is he hitting first, and why? Scorpion must be trying to poison the city's reservoir. Another Oscorp-owned property. Hello, 
Spider-Man. We've never been properly introduced. I'm o Otto Octavius. There is no Icarus, is there? No. Martin needs no assistance to secure the anti-serum. Icarus was a ruse to get you into position. Into position? Huh? to work for a man like Octavius. Backup plans for his backup plans. MJ, hey! Pete, are you okay? What's happening? Traffic's rough. Listen, Lee's gunning for the anti-serum. We need to find Oscorp's Devil's Breath Lab before he does. On it right now. I'm pulling every building permit in the city. If there's a record of the lab, I'll find it. That's great! Okay. Uh, uh, talk soon, MJ! Trap failed? Softened him up. Time for plan B. One to go. What's happening? Electro's been grounded. Spider-Man, I presume. If you really cared about this city, you'd be helping me expose Osborne for the criminal he is. By killing innocent people? I would have restored the power. You're sick. You need help. I have all the help I need. And we will not stop until Norman gets what he deserves. when they team up. I just need to catch my breath. What time? Oh, man. Now, if I was a mercenary dressed like a scorpion, where would I be? Behind you! <laughs> Me, I'd end it now. But Octavius is paying. And he wants to torture you, which I respect. Damn it! What did he inject me with? Not gonna be that easy. Sure it is. Now I know you're the poison trying to distract me. Bring it on! If I was your own. Hope that's the last of them. I can barely stand up. There's the equipment I need. Finally. I'm ready. I think I can I feel it. Where'd my suit go? Right over here. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <coughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. 
Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? No, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. Quiet, quiet. So much for a milk run. How did a bunch of convicts even do this? Looks like an exploding bulldozer went through here. Oh, come on, Crate, be the one. <gasps> Moxicillin. Perfect. That is a very large man. I found the exploding bulldozer. Supply loops and schedules. Now! Just as out! Gentlemen, I apologize. My associate is inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. Stop! <gasps> Did not need to see that. What was that? Check it. Now. Mistake, kid. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? Like this? <laughs> Kids right. got guts. Hip squared. What the hell's he saying? Not gonna be saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! You want to taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. You want to taste? I gotta work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. size, Rhino. There is no one my size, Hulk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Okay, Rhino. Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Rhino's hitting his super move. 
What did Octavius promise you, Scorpion? Money. Gargan has no bridge. He fights for profit. Ah! That's a Gargan. Ah! Ah! Do you know what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed? I failed? Yes, you, freak show! A little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Excuse me, the lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to uh, temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. Please remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. More like Osborne's safety. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Elevator controls in the security room next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson, super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the elevator. But useless button. Hmm. <sighs> what? This can't be for Harry, can it? I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27, Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? Oh, no. Come on, come on, come on, come on.
damn it. We have a breach. High alert. You're amazing. <laughs> it's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. my men, destroy my equipment, and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen, I don't like you, you don't like me, but Lee has your client inside this building right now, and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other, or we could fight Lee, but not both. mean we're good? You will help me secure Norman. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. Lee's out of control. You secure Osborne. I will talk to them. He's different. to me! You're more than your past! Don't let it control you! I tried so hard to make my parents proud! To honor their legacy! But to truly honor them, Osborne must see justice! I won't let you do this, Martin!
Lee's pain. His anger. It's fueling his power. I'm sorry. It was an accident. I was trying to help you. Yeah. You don't help people. You use them. This won't bring your parents back. Trying to save you, Martin. Don't let revenge win. Fight it. I know. But this is the wrong way, Martin. on your face. You can't imagine. 
imagine how satisfying it is. Ready for your final act? I would not worry about him right now. He needs a hospital. No. No hospital. Feast. I need to speak to your head doctor. There's no doctors here. Well, who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do my best. I'll need masks, uh, gloves, right. whatever you have to sterile. Thank you. You can thank me by not dying. Oh, my God. They say she could go at any moment. Where are you going? I need to find Otto. He has the anti-serum. <laughs> Maybe you can't. Maybe Spider-Man needs help from his friend Peter. What? Peter helped build those arms, remember? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Go get him, Tiger. It's not it. Maybe it's this one. No. Uh, uh. Spider-Man. Hello. Man, I gotta change this number. I must leave, Brooke. Recent events. Give me pause. Your rescue of Osborne, despite his hatred, it affected me. I must return home. Reflect on this life I choose. Dang. I think I'm actually gonna miss you and your death troopers. Unfortunately, my agents will stay. Though I question our work, they do not. And Osborne continues to pay. I am sorry. So close to being good news. Indeed. I will miss you and your bizarre witticism, Spider-Man. Until we meet again. What a strange, violent lady. Did the impossible, Doc. But now I have to destroy it. 
with a little creation of my own. to beg? Not gonna happen! <laughs> the world will know the truth before they mop you off the pavement. Oh! Oh! Tell them what you did! I... never... Oh! Everything you have is built on lies! Lies! Oh! You stole my company, my ideas. Now, the truth. The truth. Okay. The truth is, you were only ever worth a damn when you worked for me. The truth is, you could never accept that I'm better than you. You're a failure, Otto, and you always will be. Otto, you've worked your whole life to help people. Please. You're fighting the wrong man. But have it your way. Enough of this! Let you win. This means too much to me. Not more than it means to me. You see all the people you're hurting? 
understand! You haven't suffered like I have! Not tired. Just hurt. If you want to change the world, you have to be the kind of man who can make the hardest decisions. <gasps> I couldn't agree more! saw you as a son. I should have known you'd turn on me, just like all the others. Turn? Turn? I've worshipped you, your mind, your conscience, wanting to help others, the way you never gave up. That's because men like us have a duty, a responsibility to use our talents in the service of others. Even if they don't appreciate it, we have to do what's best for those beneath us, whether they understand it or not. No, you're wrong! You are everything I wanted to be! You just threw it away! Yes, of course. You're right, Peter. Oh. I see that now. The neural interface affected my mind. But I can fix it. We can fix it together. If you'll help me. Do everything I can. I'll make sure you get the best help. No! If they put me away, they'll take my arms. I'll be trapped in this useless body! Please, Peter. That wasn't me. You said you'd never abandon me. You promised. Remember? And of course, you rest easy, knowing your secret is safe with me. You do what you think is best, Doc. It's all any of us can. Peter? Even when it hurts like hell. Peter, where are you going? Peter? Still viable. We'll need the entire sample as a base to produce more doses. How long will that take? A few hours. Maybe a day. What if we use it to cure someone right now? 
then there won't be enough to cure the others. I'll give you a few minutes. You're gonna be okay, ma'am. I've got the cure right here. Take off your mask. I want to see my nephew. You knew? I've known for a while. I never wanted you to worry. I did. And I am so proud of you. And Ben would be too. All the people you've saved. I don't know what to do. Yes, you do. So? Hi, Mary Jane Watson, associate editor. Congrats. <laughs> Thank you. I knew you could do it. <laughs> what about you? Find a job yet? Oh, no, but, uh... I'll be right with you, honey. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I was actually considering maybe a career change. Hmm? Yeah, I think I might want to become a chef. <laughs> I'm sorry, no, it's... You're a scientist. A good one. Yeah, the last project I worked on, I created a monster octopus that almost destroyed the city, so... Yeah. I mean, you do make a hell of a chicken curry. <laughs> I do. <laughs> Still working on my dumplings, though. Going camping? Oh, uh, my uh, new place isn't gonna be ready for about a week, so I'm gonna be crashing with Miles for the next few nights. Oh. You know... You can always stay at my place. Only if you want to. No, I, I, mean, I mean, I mean, yes, I mean, no, no, I don't I not want to, but meaning I, I, I do want to, but only if you do. 
I never stopped wanting to. Me neither. Well, I'm not an expert or anything, but I think it's in the way that you ask her. I'm getting too nervous. <laughs> hey, all right, so where do you want this? Uh, right over here is fine. All right. Hey, so Pete? Yeah. I, uh, kind of got to talk to you about something I can't tell my mom about. What's up? Well, um, weird things have been going on. Like, physically. Oh. Oh, uh, well, you know, you're at that age where, where your, your body starts to change. And so you may be noticing some areas, no. for example. Not that. Uh, I think it's, I think it's better that I just, um, I show you, I show no, you. No, 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 no. It's pretty weird, right? Not that weird. So close. But I'll keep trying. I will find a cure. I will. I love you, son. <laughs> 